A couple involved in an extraordinary fertility clinic mix-up is talking about what happened to them for the first time. CBS 2's Dick Brennan has a story. It was just... It was heartbreaking. Ani and Ashot Manukian say they've been devastated by what they call an unimaginable mix-up by the Cha Fertility Center in Los Angeles involving three different couples. Cha put my family through a living hell. We're like zombies. We could not sleep, eat, or focus. We were helpless. It was awful. The Manukians say the fertility center transferred their embryo to an unidentified New York woman who then gave birth to their son along with another couple's baby. The New York couple is Korean American and they were expecting to have um, two girls. Um, and uh, they had two boys. Um, and Ani and Ashot's boy is Armenian. A DNA test revealed the error, and it was six weeks before the Manukians finally got to see their son. Now the couple is suing the center. Cha robbed me of my ability to carry my own child, my baby boy, to be with him in the first couple of, you know, moments of his life, to nurse him, to just do like skin on skin contact. So how could this happen? I am totally shocked and I am totally dismayed. Fertility doctor Jeffrey Steinberg says a mix up like this is extraordinary. Before an embryo can go back into a patient, the computerized records have to be reviewed by the medical director myself uh, and the physician if there's another physician involved. The paper records have to be reviewed, the signatures have to be reviewed, and then the entire staff gets together and question the patient. And further agonizing for the Manukians, they say the fertility center never explained what happened to all of their embryos. Ani and Ashot have no idea if there is another baby in this world of theirs that they're unaware of right now. Now, Ani Manukian says her son that she was finally united with is, in her words, a perfect baby. Attorneys for the clinic have not responded for requests for comments.